Other news today, a child chokes to death every five days in this country. And a two-year-old boy would have become one of those statistics the other day, but he didn't, thanks to the quick action of a police officer and a device we've told you about before, the life vac. A police officer races to save a toddler. It's an emergency, but first he needs something in the trunk. Where's it at? Where's it at? There we go. He grabs what he needs and runs to the stricken two-year-old boy. Hey. Hang on, buddy. Hang on. He assembles the device. Here. Put him down. Put him down. And places it over the boy's mouth. Okay. okay. Ready, buddy? Ready? Yes. Hold that on his face, okay? Yes. Hold that tight. He plunges it once. Did I get it out? No. Okay, it's come on, buddy. Stuck. Come on, buddy. It's stuck. Come on, buddy. After several more yeah. plunges. There, there we go. go. There we go. Yeah. Look at that, buddy. Thank Success. You so, look at that. Thank you so much. Look at that. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Oh my God. Hey, you okay, bud? This is what was lodged in his throat. A toy hey, okay, nail more than two inches long. The device is called a life vac. We've told you about situations where life vacs save the day. Like little Gabriel, who choked on a piece of pancake at a restaurant. A total stranger rushed to his car to retrieve his life back, and he saved baby Gabriel. Hi, Gabriel. Is huh? And here is Gabriel today. Oh, thank you so much for, for allowing us to share the video with America. Major Hillard is the man who saved his life. I'm just happy I could help at least just one person. And through the effect of that and obviously the show, to be able to help others not have that unfortunate circumstance and that loss of life, I mean, that's, that's just awesome. They were among the guests at a special event celebrating 1,000 lives saved by LifeVac. 63 were saved thanks to viewers learning about the LifeVac right here on Inside Edition. Thank you to everyone who watched Inside Edition and were inspired first by baby Gabriel and then the other families whose stories we've shared um, to go out there and get a life vac. Arthur Lee invented the life vac. As simple as place, push, pull. You literally invented this in your garage. I did. I had simplified it down to it's stuck in a pipe. Who unclogs pipes? Plumbers. So I went and looked in the plumber aisle, saw a little plunger, put it on my face, felt it pull it and I just re-engineered it to pull instead of push. I can't help but wonder how many amazing things are going to happen because the people who might have died from choking didn't. And all of us at Inside Edition are honestly thrilled to see that the stories we've done about this device have had so much life-affirming impact on so many.